Hey, good morning, everybody. It's Jonathan here from Zen Innovation. I'm here with Jen from Cuber. How are you, hey, Jen? Hey, everyone. Good, thank you. It's good. It's a fabulous uh, what day? Wednesday, is it? Yeah, it's yeah. a beautiful day. Uh, so here we're continuing on in our series about competitive intelligence with uh, different, different companies and organizations. But this is really all about talking with folks to get their perspectives on competitive intelligence. And uh, so that's why we're here. Um, so without further ado, we'll just start out maybe uh, discussing generally. Can you tell me a little bit about your company and uh, who are you and what are you doing? All right. So I am co-founder of Cuber. And Cuber is a mobile app that helps people to save money and also manage their money better. Okay. Um, so we've taken the old concept of saving jars mm -hmm. that people used to take their change and put right, them into. Right, right. And we've brought them into a mobile app, mm -hmm. um, and then we show people how they can actually achieve their goals. Cool. So kind of a modern day piggy bank, if you will. Exactly. Yeah. Very yeah. cool. Um, and so what is it that you can do for consumers and why should they, what's the benefit of downloading your app? Yep. So if you think about traditional budgeting tools, um, what most of them do is let you know the month. Um, after where mm -hmm. you spent your money right so what we do is actually proactively help people reach their goals um, while it's happening okay so it's actual behavior changes um, with spending and showing people how to make better decisions cool that's awesome now so that's kind of the consumer side you're also interested in working a bit with uh, retail banks and retailers so can you tell me a little bit about that yeah. So we're actually um, looking to work with financial institutions to help mm -hmm. make Cuber be part of their mobile banking services. Um, and so that, you know, it's a one stop kind of shop to help mm -hmm. people manage their money. Right. Um, and then as far as retailers go, we're looking to work with retailers in order to offer consumers um, rewards, discounts mm -hmm. in one platform. Um, so, you know, we know people are saving, let's say, for a trip, um, and then we partner with a tra travel agency that can say, hey, you can buy your trip now for $1,500 as right. opposed to the $2,000 you thought it was going to cost. Cool. So I, I could potentially take a nice discounted trip. Exactly. Very That's cool. Yep. That's awesome. Um, so you, you've had some time, you've been into some uh, different international markets. So generally, how did you find that experience? Yeah, we were accepted into a fintech accelerator in Singapore, and, mm -hmm. and that was a great experience for us because Singapore is really a huge fintech hub. There's a lot mm. of uh, financial institutions, large financial institutions, and we knew because we did a lot of analysis before we went, so it was a big decision to actually take that time and, and go there. But we knew um, the state of financial institutions there. Mm -hmm. um, not, not a lot have these um, sort of new digital tools to help people manage their money. And they're looking to get right. there. Right. Um, so that, that was one of the big drivers for us is that it, it was an area where people are looking to uh, invest in product mm. that, we're, that we're offering. Right. So it was a really cool hub to kind of get connected into. Absolutely. Is it a great place to travel mm -hmm. to other countries mm. in that region as well. Right. And a beautiful place to travel as well. Yes. Yeah. So we did Thailand, Singapore, Indonesia, um, and we also met, met some contacts from India. Very cool. That's awesome. Um, so now what we've been talking about is the concept of competitive intelligence. So I do want to touch on that. Um, so competitive intelligence can help um, inform your strategy. So in that case, when you're going into an international market, what are the sorts of things you want to consider with respect to information when you're going in? Yeah, so a lot of the research we did was, you know, what, what are our competitors out there? Who mm -hmm. are they? Um, and, and we're lucky in that market, actually. There's not a lot of people focusing um, in our area. Mm -hmm. So we were one of the first ones to get in uh, in, in that area, in Asia. Um, and, and then we also needed to know, okay, well, how, what, what's happening with fintech there? So mm -hmm. in a lot of countries in Asia, um, they don't have ways to do digital payments yet. Right. right. So that's one of the areas that they're focusing on is mm. building up that ability so that you don't need to have cash right. to spend. Mm. Um, and then, so it was very important for us, okay, who are those partners um, mm -hmm. that we could look at uh, working with right. 
because they're using you know QVR codes and mm -hmm. things to purchase items so then they have more of the information or the transactions right. that we need so we right. looked at, at partnerships we looked at people who are who are investing in mm -hmm. fintech right. um, and also obviously customers right yeah right makes a lot of sense um, and so obviously you've got an app you've got a product um, so a lot of companies out there are building products sort of similarly um, so from your perspective, for a product-based business, um, what do you see as the importance of using CI to really help inform your product roadmap and your strategy? Yep. Um, so we've do, done research on our competitors. Um, some of the information that we gather is, are they direct to customer, which a lot of them are, or mm -hmm. direct to consumer? Or are they looking to partner with financial institutions? What mm -hmm. financial institutions are they working with? Um, you know, what are people saying about their tools? Mm -hmm. That's good information. Um, who are they hiring? So we right. can see, you know, uh, if they're hiring this type of skill, probably they're mm -hmm. headed this way. Right. Um, so there's all kinds of areas that you can look at to, mm -hmm. to get some sort of information to, yeah. Very cool. Yeah. That's awesome. Um, so just uh, before I, I, we go today, I want to thank you for joining us. And uh, thanks for joining us today. Appreciate it.